So Chad Wheeler's girlfriend speaks out um, and then Chad Wheeler awful also is posting on his social media saying that it was in response to a, a bipolar episode and that he's sorry for the damage he's caused, yada, 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 yada. My problem with this is that we live in a society today where people have every excuse in the book for not taking responsibility for their own actions. Um, there's people with mental illnesses, people with all kinds of things that they're going through and they don't abuse people, they don't kill people, they don't um, harm other people. Um, and so, get, don't be all in my comments talking about what da, 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 da. I'm not here for that. I'm just telling you what my observation is um, in my experience as a domestic violence victim and a survivor on the other side of it. Um, but I'm very proud of her for um, coming forward, not being ashamed, not hiding her face because many times victims of domestic violence are ashamed. They live in fear of retaliation, um, of, you know, of just embarrassment. And I am so proud of her because there's so much victim shaming. On my last video, um, when this first happened, I posted a video. Um, it had over like 5,000 views and a gang of comments. Go watch that if you haven't seen that. But there's so many people in the comments. Well, she shouldn't be dating a white boy. Well, she shouldn't do this. Well, she shouldn't do that. And all the focus is on her. Come on, you guys. Are we really that naive? Are we really, really that small? Are we really that immature? To where we going to blame somebody, a victim, for being abused by someone who has some serious issues and yes he may have bipolar order but bipolar order any other order depression whatever it is not an excuse to violently attack okay and hurt another person so you can bump all that bump it I don't want to hear it yada 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 there's no excuse because if it was your sister your mother then you wouldn't care you wouldn't say whatever you would be like what are you serious you'd be like come on come on now what come, what you wouldn't be like okay well you know she shouldn't be there no I, a man she shouldn't be doing that well if she would have been people like no he did what a grown man put his hand on a woman or you know and and, and people were saying well women abuse men we ain't talking about that we're not talking about women abusing men we're talking about the topic that you came for and to this channel for so don't be in my comments posting about that either the point is that this is not nothing new. Domestic violence is not nothing new. But what we have to do is uh, change the dialogue from victim shaming, victim blaming to awareness, you know, of supporting victims of domestic violence and giving them the support that they need so that they don't have to go back to these situations and holding the men accountable who are doing this. Okay, put that if they need to be shamed. Okay, yeah, you have to bipolar order. But what I want to see more of is people really taking accountability, not using it as a cover up for their behavior. So, you know, come on social media and be real. Hey, man, I messed up. I was a jerk. I was a whatever. I messed up real bad. I hope people, my fans and my ex girlfriend can forgive me. Okay, respect on that. But everything else is punking out. So I don't want to hear nothing else. Tell me what y'all think in the comments.